I've marked in red all the acts and jurisdictions in the contract. Make this longer to refer to. But I've broken it down like that so I can understand um, what the judge is, is. That's his language. The blackmail is the birth certificate that everybody talks about as being the counter signature of what I signed as the bail bond to get out of prison. That making me sign to someone else that countersigned to get the money out from somewhere that I want to claim as an inheritance for that name. So I want that person to turn up at court, John Wanoa in capital. That's what those other guys were trying to do, but they, they couldn't do that in, in the judge's court. Like those other sovereign fellows, they just, that's not the way to do it. The, day, the, the way to do it is contest yourself. There's someone acting and purporting to be me. That's, that's the part that I'm, 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 I'm wanting to show who did it, who, who wrote those documents. And it looks like her, I'm accusing her of blackmail. 
those legal documents are they bar association agreements. If not, then it's not admissible in the court because it's a flint stamp, not lawyer. There are police doing it all the time, but you have to catch them doing it. You have to find a cause of someone who, who's all adds up to injury against you in the admiralty too. That's worse. It's crossing into the admiralty law of mortgages and land. See? So there's a number of things that he's not a lawyer. You'll understand that more than her as a French woman. Who gave her the authority to use those to come into my room? There's no seals on it from the court or seal from the Queen. That's what I want to disclose, the seal. I want the seal of the court disclosed, the authority to arrest me with those documents. Not the arrest warrant. I'm not thinking about arrest warrant. I'm saying about the documents are faulty. I think a, a lot of the people watching me can see that there's something wrong with the documents. Someone, the author, the author, that's, that's, that's the thing. The author of the documents should be disclosed. This is between me and her. I'm very proficient in what I do, but is she? I think you'd know what that means. They've violated your law and your profession. So if I was in the Bar Association, association I'd be in the Law Commission. I, I'd be very upset. investigated me, now I'm investigating her. Mm. Mm. I have a right as a native to investigate our native title on our land who's using it. That's where the British step in. Because we still have a contract with them. With our flag. That's the Admiralty flag that allowed them to be on the land in the first place. That's my level of profession, knowledge. So really it's just challenging her document. <laughs> Don't be like the year. <laughs> Makes your job easier. So it's complications or or any thing that is not in it? We're talking about the judge's law. Or the abuse of it. And the use of it. My chief wants, Kingi Toto wants to know the outcome of this meeting today because they're pushing me and I have to watch my heart. I understand. Oh, it's all right. Uh, it's all right. I, uh, I've been going to the gym. Yeah. But then they told me, I, I, I told them, oh, I'm going to stop taking my medication for a month. Mm. And up she jumps.
Yeah. And they checked me out of there. Yeah. I haven't been back since. <laughs> 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 but I'm going back. I'm, I'm paying to go there. What's, what's your um, motivation for stopping in these places? Oh, it was to see if my theories are right that uh, uh, I can fix myself. Oh, I see. But it didn't work. No. No. <laughs> so I'm back on it again. <laughs> Oh, it slows down the blood pressure, and uh, see, I'm wearing a Fitbit. Yeah, yeah. My daughter's bought me a Fitbit. Yeah. I think there's a very expensive one, but it just shows the pulse. Yeah. At least I can see yeah. when I don't take it up. She goes. I saw a thing recently where they um, there was a chap that showed up in the emergency room, mm. and um, they saw a strip that they said, "Hold on, why don't we connect up to that?" And then yeah. they Wi-Fi. They actually found a very ir irregular rhythm. Wi-Fi, yeah. yeah. They can take yeah. it off Wi-Fi. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> he ended up saving his life. Yeah. So, so being Wi-Fi, I can tune in to the doctor or someone if it goes too high and their phone will ring. So they just sent me this non -dis uh, disclosure, which doesn't show me much. It just shows much of the same on the 7th. So long for them to send it, but mm -hmm. you would have had, you would have got the other bit of it. What 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 did you get that you can give to me? If you can copy that one, and then to see what the other, a full disclosure I meant to be full. Yeah. And what I've written to you about, you'll have to digest and. Yeah, I don't know that I received this one. I don't think so because it's come late. And. Um, what you've got, I need a copy of. Okay, that's easy enough to make sure. And you can copy that one, and um, then we've got those. I want to see yep. how much of a disclosure they've given me. You're at Penrose, are you, John? No, Otterby. Otterby, sorry. Yeah, Otterby. Um, so, um, but there's nothing too much in, in that lot that I wanted to disclose. So you'll be the, the judge of that to, to interpret what I'm saying, in the, so that that's an understanding. Okay. What I'd probably need to do is um, get back to my machine at my home office so that mm -hmm. I can kind of get the emergency pop right. order uh, punch and punch in. I should have done that, but that's because you're right, I should have prepared that ahead and mm. that gone before you today, so I'm sorry. But well, that's I, okay. I Today, yeah, um, with a view to maybe an appropriate correction tomorrow. Okay. Um, what was I going to say? I'd like to talk to you in mm -hmm. terms of your notes are very helpful. Yeah. Um, of course, not every not every seed finds um, soil. Mm -hmm. So some things in there, I, I would suggest, are perhaps a little bit less priority than others. Mm -hmm. um, in terms of my analysis of. Mm -hmm. of um, the difficulty I, I, I find in terms of your expectations as to outcomes that some things are, are possible to be kind of forced and other things are not. Mm -hmm. um, but we're just talking about one person here. Yes. That's I mean, I, I mean, as I as I interpret the, the central the central um, allegation is that there there was uh, evidence that it was false. Not consciousness. And evidence that had been, um, in the language of the, of the evidence act, mm -hmm. uh, improperly attacked. Mm -hmm. um, what that requires, I would suggest, and here's an application um, properly to the judge, yes. asking them to declare it as improperly attacked, yes. and therefore inadmissible. Yes. Yeah. Um, in the absence of inadmissible evidence, and then of course it says that a, a further application our evidence is limited to um, our, our concern is limited to the account of of um, Miss Brown, Flower D. Brown, then we um, we still have the hurdle of the other witnesses that the police intend to bring, um, which is to say the the, the attending officer at the site was there at the scene, suggested that we're located 
But it's their third party, so you know, yes. the landowners yes. are, are, are the, the, they've come in as third party. Mm. So that's that's yeah. technical. Yeah. I mean, I, 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 I we have a we have a default contract yes. with the landowners, and anybody else that comes into it is dragged in. Well, where I some of the difficulty of having a two-party process mm. today is that. I see where you're coming from with the, the native um, that title and that yeah. thing. That, that's all fine. We have the um, we have to do some more investigation as to what happened with your your um, application for KDH on the land. Mm -hmm. Then, in the absence of the application, for the absence of, of the of the caveat, then if it wasn't registered on the title, as I understand it, or the land. They wouldn't put it on. Yeah. What was the, did they give you an explanation as to why they? They just said flat out you had no interest. I see. He had no. That's a chief there too. Yeah. Manukau. I see. He was he was there too. Yeah. And and um, um, I've got all the memorials for for Auckland with, with the with the um, plaque for the one one for Hill. We went through all that process. Yeah. With with all the chiefs here. I see. And I stand up north. Yeah. To which they wear that title. Yeah. In terms of in terms of that um, title and that discussion mm -hmm. with the land office, do you have any correspondence outlining it? It's all on YouTube. Uh, right. All on all okay. on all online. Okay. It's on my Facebook. Sixty eight that's got his Facebook post is admissible in courts now. In most courts now are using Supreme Courts are using Facebook because they can identify that they're fake. Right? That's the tec technical term. Mm -hmm. Is what you say in public that can be used against me or for me. So anyway, that that's all on on. The, I can pull it all off online. They can just go online and get it all. Um, that's that's evident um, in affidavits. A lot of it's in affidavits. Um, on the affidavit front, where where would I find support for the affidavit. You uh, just asked me which ones you want and I just pulled it off. No, but uh, when you say that you've supplied three affidavits to mm. me. Oh, for the landowners? Yeah. Yeah, those are online too. But I, what... I went quick in I person. It's on video. Yes, yes, I understand mm. it's on video, but what, when you say that three affidavits weren't rebutted and then you had claims to the land. Well, I have what claim to what I'm saying yeah. as my word against his. I see. If they don't answer, then they give me legal right that it's true. There's evidence in, in so court. Where do you where do you um there's an act for that. Okay. Yeah, I'm referring to those acts all the time. I but see. there was a transfer a tra a, a, a transfer a land transfer act. And and a, and a contract law. All that sort of stuff is going further than just this case. And and any lands up in Admiralty that part of, of the title. The, the so the, there's a British title. Just right? just to jump around for a moment, mm -hmm. the um, the occupants of the Cook Street address at the moment mm -hmm. are they are they the ones with the improper title or no. are they tenants? They're that? tenants. Okay. They're tenants. The, the, um, only the two landowners stood aside and watched them from along the road, going through all the calculation for those markers. I see. I, I, and I didn't enter the office, yet they came in for okay. breaking into. I stood out on the road. Did you understand that that's what the other chaps were going to do? Oh yeah, I put them on contract to do it. I see. I made it clear, clear that they, 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 they are markers. I see. They got their badges for markers. So I thought, well, if you want a job, you, you, you do what you say you do. Sure. Was that written contract or yep. oral? Yep, written, signed. Sitting there and doing the contract, signed. They signed it. And what was the content of the contract that you had? The contract was to seize the land because I went to the chief to tell him I'm going to seize it and the CRD. And, and, and Philip Taylor, he's, he, he was, he, he's the CRD officer in Otaheite. I rang him up. 
picked the wrong one. I said, I'm going down three further than that. So she's done ahead for me before in, in London. And so I'm down about the fourth place. What was the view in town that you were going to go to for the meeting? She said, well, he, he has no jurisdiction from out of here. He used to when he was in town, but he, he, had, he, see, he just said, go to the CRB in town. So that's where I went. I just told, I went up to counter. I always go there and report. Because she said, whatever you do, I'm supposed to make new findings, yeah. take it in. Yeah. So I sat down and told him, this is what I do. This is what I do. Every time I go on that block, I go there and drop it. I write, I write him, I write there, in front of the officer, and then over the counter, here it goes. So everything has been recorded right up to the point, this is years later, on my intention, was quite clear, 60 years ago. No, even 10 years ago, 2008. So there's a clear track yeah. all the way through of events leading up to going on that bubble. I had to make sure that my chief approved yeah. many times, has approved what I'm doing was good from a major should be sitting on the other side of the King James Court. It should be a King James Court native judge. That's me. I'm actually playing out being the judge on the other side of these native titles, which I have a right to speak for our land on whose honour. Because John Peel doesn't have three titles here. Yeah. Well, he says he's titled. Are you, uh, I mean, in terms of the original cases, mm -hmm. do you... I got the whole lot, yeah. Okay. I got everything because I was fresh in the air today. Yeah. And I learnt how to do it. What do you think the basis of them rejecting your claim was? They just said we had no financial interest. Okay. We didn't have any, any financial invested interest in the property. But under the Mary Land Act and the 1962 Land Transfer Act, it states quite clearly if there are other interests in the title, they must be registered by law. Well, they failed that. And with the one on, the judge's rogan who put these titles together in Auckland and married my family, one on, and Manukau. So it really put a damper on the old man, um, Mahi Manukau, and his title is his birth certificate that's been given with his, the dates on it, 1830. That's a title while I was here during the youth. Okay. But um, I'm just saying that it's challengeable. Everything's a challenge on jurisdiction, for one, and title. Where did you get it from? Whose authority? And where's your seal? There ain't no seal on those documents. They haven't got a seal on the courts here from Westminster. The Queen is in EU Parliament, constantly being input of the Governor General. I went through all this exercise on YouTube for no, a long time, proving that the Queen is in Brussels with her financial interests and not Westminster. Now, this government is still running on the multi propria. The, the Pope destroyed all the trusts and corporations, and I've got all the dates for that in the scripture they gave me. I can use that so instrument. On the, on the one hand, we rely on the Pope destroying all the corporations. But on the other hand, you say that my power group is itself a corporation. Yeah, Plan. yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm acting in the King's corporate, not the Queen's corporate. Okay. Two different entities. Two different crowns, two different coronations, and two different jurisdictions. The Queen came out of the King. That's what I'm challenging on the Marae and Westminster. 
they know this. They know they know what I'm doing. And I'm saying they can't turn a blind eye here because we've got a new Britain now. And we are the other third one because Scotland's coming out its own way and left England and Wales. And I've already put intentions to put our flag up there. So Charles Hirschfeld's been telling me what to do as far as that's concerned. All right. It might be an idea for me to talk to Charles. Yeah. Um, He's the, he's the first, we're really, who's going to go on there now? He's me, her, him, me, and Tuna Cora. Tuna Cora was uh, Secretary Palmer's uh, marriage policy manager. She made all the laws for the 1896 Constitution. She did. No, she's on my side. That's why I know so much from her. And, and, and that covers the Maori out there. And what I'm saying about a native judge on the other side of the two things state. He's supposed to have a Maori judge there. They took it out. They legislated it out. But we're in a contract with Britain, and they can't interfere with that. That's why they can't choose our flag. John King can't choose our flag. And he's, he, it's a conflict of interest, him putting another flag in front of ours. Oh, look, I don't, I don't disagree with you <laughs> whatsoever on that front. So, but that's getting into things. You know, I'm just saying. I mean, I... Present purposes, I, I appreciate that there's a lot of other things that we want to see. It has to be done. Resolved. Yeah, it has. The judge has to make a determination. On well, it. Th I think that's sort of where I, what I was getting at is that I, I would suggest that the judge would say that he doesn't need to make a determination on that, and mm -hmm. that's, that's what I wanted to prepare you for. Is I think that in the district court judge will be to then actually determine to limit it to what he deems or she yeah. deems is the core issue. So it will only be between her and me? Well, it, it will it will only be a, an instance of looking at, as far as the judge is concerned, whether conduct has constituted an offence, and for our purposes, w what our task is, is to look at your circumstances and fit them into those aspects and send them back to the cases laid against you. Um, I agree with you. I think there are some, some evidential issues in, in terms of what she's done there, but there are other aspects that I don't know from a sitting district court judge's perspective whether they'll be helpful for you. Think of the ramifications, for example, if, if the judge were to say, that serving police officers exceed their brief when intervening in a dispute where there's an unregistered land interest which has been applied for but not entered. Do you, do you see how the, the, the various aspects fit together as far as the judge is concerned? It's still a fault of the land information. I, 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 I appreciate that. I appreciate that, but I don't know that a judge is going to go... Um, then it has to go to the high... It would go straight into the High Court in London, and they'll rule, yeah. because it can't, it's, it's still... Well, I, I think that, that's probably helpful then, because at least at least then we have documentation of, of your interest not being, not being properly recognised in a court setting here, which will give you... Um, no, but that's more expense. That's what right. I'm trying to avoid yeah. for the court because they, they think by going into court it's going to cost a lot of money and more and more and more and more publicity. Yeah. That's bad publicity. This. Sure. this is bad publicity. It is. And it's making it look bad on the government and they're getting, getting uh, uh, looked at. It's, it's, it's too much. There's too much online. There's too much evidence against the government. Mm -hmm. And the government's looking a lot shakier with uh, uh, the Panama tax savings are in here too. Oh, sure, yeah. That's in uh, this lot. I, I mean, we all knew it from, from the beginning that they were a dirty but bunch of bastards. So. Yeah, yeah, but it's, it's still business. It's, it's tampering with business. Mm. It's tampering with my business between here and Britain. Where is, where is Maui Powers Representative's registered? 
Um, no, and your sheet is simply there. I, I, I didn't do it because in 2012, I spoke to our residents there. I was going there to live yeah. and, and set up there, but it's still there. They just said to me, they won't reach it until I get I the finished bit. Right. So I've showed everybody and um, I sent it to you, the, the company itself, Limited, okay. in London. That should have been going now if it wasn't for this book there. Hold on. Hold on. So please, hold on. So when the judge looks at it, he's going to say, is it worth a case doing anything with it, or is better be swatted for the sake of saving face? Yeah. That's what I'm saying. It's, 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 it's putting everything out. So what is, what is the outcome that you want to realize? All I want to do is to get a writ from the judge in, 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 in the probable cause that there's too much evidence on my, in my favor against injuries, being injured by a number of people okay. against the law itself, okay? That I get a writ to seize the land and, and, and to uh, enforce them well. Those two things. That's it. That's all I want. No, yeah. not the money. I don't want the money. No, I just want the land. Yeah, I mean, oh. I, I, don't, I don't see that. I don't even know if that's if that's within the Southern District Court judge's purview, whether that's if the state hold a, a warrant from the government. They do. I've been reading it. Make such a declaration. Yeah, it's in there. I've written it. Okay. I've written all the years. Okay. And that, those are the that's the yeah. Ones that you it's in there. Yeah. You it's in there. Okay. It's, uh, it's, in, it's in the, the pipe one that I sent you of there okay. to have marked them. All right. So there is, uh, there is ways for the judge to make a determination on what you can see okay. uh, in that part. A constitutional lawyer would pick it out straight away. Okay. Some, someone who, who's doing land uh, contracts, yeah. uh, construction contracts, they'll pick it out straight away. Okay. That's why I'm saying I'm, I'm, I've been teaching myself uh, for my own sake, so I know what I'm talking about. At least I, I'm not a lawyer, but I can understand well, that the law is clearly broken. Mm. It's, it's broken yeah. by one person. The well, rest is just around what you come between me and those landowners. That's our private right. It's a private contract. But do you think that the remedy then... No, I don't want remedy. The, the, what, what I'm saying to you is, if, if it's the if it's the writ that you're seeking to mm -hmm. and it's on the basis of the transgressions of Miss Flower Duke Brown, yeah, in competing, that if do you if if I mean if as a as a separate example, somebody came to your house mm -hmm. and they were on your well your property, let's, I mean, it's not the best example, and then a third person came and they punched him in the face, mm -hmm. and you haven't invited the, or the third person, or maybe you did, mm -hmm. what do you consider that that person that got punched then had immediate claim to your home? No. 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 Okay. But to, to his damage, injury, that's what yeah. I'm talking about, injury. Personal injury, me yeah. and that person that yeah. hit you. Yeah. It's not someone else yeah. who's standing in for them. So we, if you if you're looking for as a result a writ concerning mm -hmm. the land, yeah, following on from the transgressions of mm -hmm. third party Brown, just a historic claim. Okay. So they, uh, realistically, they're separate issues. Yeah, um, they're separate okay. issues. She's okay. tampered with the the, the, the original original okay. right. long standing case. All right. Okay. She had, she had, she should have got a lawyer first. She so should have got the advice. Is she acting, acting in, in as a lawyer yeah. to make decisions from in law? We're I'm talking about law. Yeah, I, I understand. I'm just trying to prepare you for the thinking mm -hmm. of, of the judge because oftentimes when things don't fit in the box, it's easier for them to try and stuff them back into that box. Mm -hmm. So, uh, I mean, uh, what a judge is likely to say in terms of her not taking the advice of a, of a land lawyer at the time is that it, it might not That's serious, be, be realistically feasible if a call is coming through of, of people entering the premises at 770 Cook Street to consult a land lawyer as to the propriety or, or, or otherwise of the property. Mm. Um, 
Yeah, so I would accept that subsequent to that he probably should should have taken a little bit more in the way of action. He he should have did that. He yeah. should have he should have got better advice. Yeah. And 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 experts. She yeah. she didn't. She made all the decisions for the police, the whole yeah. police force. She libeled them. In, yeah. in my in my okay. view, she libeled everybody. Okay. But worst of all, she used these instruments mm. to come in my house and that's serve them on me. That that that's the, the main thing. Mm. That that's really what it is. She was the author yeah. of those documents that I'm accusing. Okay. She had to say she wasn't. Okay. Right? It's 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 me, my t my intelligence is being tested here. Against her limited amount of okay. knowledge that I have right. over those documents. Yeah, that makes sense. So that's really all it is. Okay. There's nothing more, more all than right. that. All right. Well, I need to, um, I need to get on to a few things then, and that's that's looking for the um, PDF because I don't think I will start that. I need to go through and create your copy of. Then I need to um, make the request for the assets of disclosure that you've outlined there yeah. and the order that I can formulate things around that. Um, I'd like to also pick it up and report whether they consider that things were done to go ahead Monday week. Mm -hmm. So, um, what what I what I'm saying is. What she started of a process, mm. she started a process of yeah. that took a lot of people in, yeah. and 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 all those other people that got involved. There's 43 people altogether. Mm. That that cost me the money's coming from somewhere. I want to find where that money's coming mm. from. Yeah. From me yeah. and my shadow mm. team, yeah. Don Wanawa. Mm. That's who I want because I signed it. Yeah. The document. I signed. Yeah, we need to get that. You need to get that, and I want to find. I want to audit on that account to yeah. see how much because I got a claim. It says in those acts I've got a claim to that money. Okay. Because it's got my name on it, and it looks like me. I want to find who who that person is. That account has signed that. Yes, I understand. Oh, that's just another one. Yeah. It can go this way, that way, and every way, every other way. To um. Is this your copy? You sent me a copy of this one. Right? No, uh, uh, um, I can give you that copy. Okay. That's original. What I'll do is I will. I've got a copy. I'll, I'll put a scan to my okay. machine and I'll and one. mail it back to you. Oh, I see. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. 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 And email it back to me. Yeah. Um, so really, I've written down everything I wanted. I I I, I expected. Okay. Uh, for you being a very proficient lawyer. Or barrister yeah. to interpret okay. the judge right. in the best way, um, really because um, I don't sleep no. properly because of unresolved matters, and I don't want the police to get away with it. No, I understand. Because there's too much. On one of yeah. my websites, I got for her only, and everything's in there okay. of of what police are being given court for him, okay. and she's no no different from the other ones that are committing crimes against those acts. Okay. And I can't see why they should have to get away with it now. No, no, I, I agree with you. Shall I um, give you a lift to your car? Yeah, thanks. That'll be good. That, that'll save my, my feet. <laughs> oh, I should be walking anyway.